Hey guys, this is Tara with Kittens, Weights, and Tarot, and I'm just jumping in very briefly uh, to let you know that tomorrow I may not have my live chat, but I will try to upload a video for you guys, um, only because I have an acupuncture appointment at 10 a.m. So if I did my live chat too early, I don't know how many people would be able to attend, um, but we'll see. I wanted to actually give you guys a tour of my altar. I got it all done up for Yule. Um, well, getting ready for Yule is it slowly approaches but you know I'm going to get into the spirit since all the Christmassy and holiday stuff is is out now that um, Thanksgiving is over as of yesterday <laughs> but of course we've had like Christmassy stuff out since like July so yeah and I also wanted to let you guys know um, so yesterday at Thanksgiving um, I found out um, that there's a couple of things that are like hereditary in my family. Um, my aunt was talking about, do you guys ever get that like vibrating heart? You know, every now and then you're like, whoa, and it feels like your heart's just vibrating and it, you can feel your pulse go up and and she says, and it, it seems to kind of jump out of nowhere. And my dad's like, yeah, I get that. And I was like, yeah, I've had that like forever. And you know, and it used to be like, um, whenever I do the 100 meters and track, you know, and I, anytime I do anything fast, like explosive, um, it feels like, uh, my heart stops like beating normally where it's like bump 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 and it's more like it goes bump 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 um, and actually with my um, my watch where I can um, tell what my heart rate is um, I was doing my workout the other day and I was doing some sprints and stairs and uh, like bleachers and things like that and um, my heart rate was going from 175 which is like my workout like intense heart workout heart rate um, to 209 which is a little higher than should be <laughs> actually a lot higher um, and it was taking several minutes for it to get down to 190 but it was still like kind of fibrillating um, but that's like you know I've even gone to the doctors for that and the doctors are like um yeah we can't really find what that is we don't know what that is so they're like you're fine I guess <laughs> so I don't know I have a wonky heart and uh, whenever I do pass away I'm donating this heart to science <laughs> or some lucky person's gonna get my very very special heart <laughs> after today's workout um, I was a little pissed off about someone and every time I thought about this person like my heart was like getting out of rhythm you know um, but it was doing it for a lot longer than normal so it was usually it's out of rhythm for like a minute two minutes max um, and this went on for like like five to seven minutes it started freaking me out and it actually brought on a panic attack which I haven't had in years um, and I'm like no 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 not a panic attack and I can feel it coming on and and I'm like no and I'm like Archangel Michael like I'm sitting at a stop right right now like I can't have a panic attack and I remember like stomping the floor in my truck and I'm like I can't have a panic attack but um, as the panic attack was subsiding and and I ended up like cool and like it out right um, from my heart rate getting raised from the panic attack actually put my heart back into the rhythm it was supposed to be in so my panic attack actually helped it get back into place so that was interesting and kind of cool <laughs> so I thought I'd share that with you guys but anyway um, let's do a quickie altar tour and then um, maybe I'll see you guys tomorrow for a live chat but if not I'll definitely get a video up there for you guys. I've got a lot going on uh, on my kind of holiday Yule slash kind of uh, just kind of the mood I'm in altar. Um, so obviously I got a, a new um, altar cloth. I uh, got that at Walmart. Um, if we go over here, um, I got this from um, the Fifth Element Life uh, where I got one of my rings. Um, but for some reason, um, well, I mean, not for some reason, but I've been working with uh, Santa Muerte, and this image reminds me of Santa Muerte. I know the, the traditional image is like a, like a, a skeletal female, um, but, you know, for me, Santa Muerte is like rebirth, new life, and to me, this really embodies and signifies that, and so... I've put this on my altar with my other goddesses to kind of like really work with her a lot more um, this season and and probably indefinitely because uh, she's coming pretty strong. Uh, this lovely item I just got today 
um, I did a trek a deck trade with somebody and um, she created this beautiful wand and I told her I said you get creative you create whatever you want so it's got these beautiful citrines um, I believe she said this is rose quartz and then we have this beautiful uh, amethyst at the top so I can't wait to work with that magical beauty um, and then today I was at Michael's and you know it's Black Friday today uh, but I needed to pick up some stain for um, this wooden like treasure chest thing that I bought at the Goodwill uh, and I cleaned it up and I'm not sure if I want to keep it or give it to um, my stepmom for Christmas and I'm thinking you know I'll probably give it to her for Christmas so I've stained it I've cleaned it up um, I'm gonna wax it up and I'm gonna like uh, shine up all the, the brassware on there and everything but anyway they gave uh, it was a free ornament with like buying a certain amount of stuff at Michael's so I had a choice of Santa Claus or a unicorn I was like uh, duh unicorn <laughs> so I got this today so I was like well that was a, a neat surprise I didn't even know that was a thing going on at Michael's right now um let's see I still have my purple candle that came from the moon box for the month of November um and it looks like I'm starting to uh, do a little collection of feathers here I just got these stones today as well from a deck trade that I did um, and so they are charging here on my beautiful uh, window pane selenite and um, my um, pentagram here uh, but this feather you guys will remember uh, is very special to me it was after I had asked the universe for a big sign if I was you know on the right path and this was like literally stuck like a bullseye in my screen and it's um, from one of our beautiful doves that's in the area. Um, I also have this feather here that I got when I was down at the reservoir and um, I saw a bunch of like beautiful white ibis or not ibis but egrets and I was like ooh like maybe I'll go over there and uh, I was like hopefully I'll find one of their feathers and I did and so I was so very happy to get one of those and then this I got from the um, local reservation and over here it's finally time to bust out one of my pine cones and I got that in Julian the last year and yeah so I got my little mini cauldron and some incense and we are good to go so everything is looking smashing and yeah I thought I would just share that with you guys and so yeah again hopefully maybe I'll go in for a live chat tomorrow but if not you know I got an acupuncture appointment but I will definitely get a video guys up for you all right so that's it for me spiritual homies if you dug this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to click subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell for more videos just like this and I'll see you spiritual homies later peace love and chicken grease peace out